want to make it dramatic. You have a very pretty long neck. You're going to showcase some of it. With the heavy bang, it's going to look good, but it's also we'll make sure that even if we, even if it does yeah. something like this, it'll look really, really good. I think that we should start with a good, strong bob. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We could always add more. You're and bob yeah, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I mean a good amount, not like all the time, but. No. Yeah, right, well, especially like... right now because there's a lot of a lot of COVID haircuts. Oh. You know what I mean? There's still people coming out of the woodwork. Let's start with just a quick. So literally, I'm just trying to get the, the, the main bulk out of here, but it'll also give us a look. Because we're catching your hair in its natural state. It's a big deal for you, Sarah. How you doing? I'm doing great. Good. You already look so different. Sarah, I'm going to have you look down some. Thank you. Who knows you're doing this? No one. <laughs> <laughs> so you're gonna go home like this? Yeah. Like and not then surprise everybody? Yeah. That's very cool. Yeah, if I asked them they probably would have said no, so <laughs> Oh, especially your mom? you are like, ah Yeah. She'll probably wanna cut her hair short too yeah. now. But see how much more bounce you got too? Yeah, it, I have absolutely no regrets. So now all that natural wave you got? You're gonna get more of that up in here too. I'm sorry, I've never seen my hair short before. <laughs> All right, so now we're gonna we're gonna wash it, and we'll finish it after we wash it. I feel like I just lost weight. <laughs> 
Oh, when you go to like wash your hair for the first time, you're gonna be like, oh, where is it? Or when you wake up in the morning, <laughs> it's tomorrow. Yeah, I mean, when I fall asleep, like I literally lay on my hair, so this will feel very different. Ring it out, right? <laughs> I was gonna say the reason why I cut Sarah's hair dry is because I was able to get like the base of the hair cut, you know, while it's in its natural state. And that was the reason why I wanted to do it dry at first, um, so that we knew where the length was gonna end up for the most part and the shape. But now we're now we're gonna finish the haircut wet so that we can get more of that precision detailing in the haircut, all right? So it's gonna be easier to do it when it's wet. It's, you know, everybody's hair is different. I mean, that's, we literally just cut Sarah's hair kind of freestyle, you know what I mean? Like, because we want to see how her hair reacts to it. Yeah, that's how you cut my bangs too. Mm-hmm. All right. So this is Color Wow, um, the uh, styling foam. So this will help to give the hair some texture and a little bit of lift. Even though she has a lot of hair, it'll still help to style it. Even if you let this air dry, it's gonna look really, really good. So. Yeah. You're going to have a lot more of your natural wave come in and do some work. And this is the Color Wild Dream Coat. Just a perfect finishing tool to seal the hair and seal the product in. I always use that. how much we can build into it. You can build your hair up. You can make it really tousled and kind of sexy. You know what I mean? That kind of bedroomy hair. Yeah. You know, we can make it really polished or we can put some, some wave into it, which we'll probably do a couple of those looks too.
I'm cutting Sarah's bangs with thinning shears, with, with texturizers, because I'm able to get a blunt look, a heavy, a heavy bang, but still with some control, with, with a bevel, and with some softness on the end. And the way I do it is I actually like to create that bevel while I'm holding the hair. So I actually bevel the hair in between my fingers. And I use the shears, not straight in, I actually bevel the shears as well. So as I'm at that tip, I'm beveling the hair and I'm beveling the shears. And I'm working on those ends. And that actually creates a beveled heavy bang for me. So she'll have that control that she needs. Sarah has a lot of hair, so we need to create some softness and control so that way she, the, her, her bangs don't take over. But she'll be back in two weeks. I love the way the bangs split, or if you want to wear them heavy, you know. Style on steroids. Make sure you try this stuff. It's the cleanest texture spray that there is on the market. It'll give you volume, but it's more texture, so it's clean too, so you can still put your hands to it, but it gives your hair a little bit of grit, and it gives your hair separation. You don't have to stand up anymore. <laughs> mm -hmm, you have a lot of hair. I, you know, it's, it, it definitely responded even better than I, than I thought. You can't mess it up. You, you can't. You do whatever you want with it. No, no, no. You, yeah, oh, right, right, right. <laughs> you can't mess it up. You can, you can throw your hands through there. You can turn it any way you want. Thank you. Edgardo Escribano, owner of Pelo by Edgardo here in Ridgefield, Connecticut. Uh, thank you, Sarah. Thank you, TJ, for doing this. Um, you know, just here trying to represent the people of Connecticut, the talent that we have here in, um, in our home state and in the town of Ridgefield. Uh, make sure you come visit us, but more importantly, you know, just keep doing what you're doing. If there's anything that we can do to help you guys, we're here. Oh, it's my pleasure. This is, you guys are helping me out too, so.